Hey guys, I'm Heavy D. And I'm Diesel Dave. And today, we're gonna get- Go, come on! Ah, son of a... Got me. As I was saying, today we're gonna get attacked by some of the most powerful protection dogs in the world. And it's not nearly as fun as it looks! Ah, okay. Gaio, come! We'll get a snack or something. Gaio! Jerk. Now look at me. How do you get up in these things? I have a paintball court like in my house. <laughs> That's... Take this off for a second. So guys, real quick, let me give you an explanation of what's going on. Because these dogs that we have here are insanely capable. And they are some of the most well-trained animals in the world. <laughs> thanks to Chad and Dave from High Caliber Protection Dogs. You see, Dave runs a uh, basically dog training facility down in uh, Spanish Fork, Utah. It's Innovative Canine. That's where they have taken my dog, the Borbul, and made him less of a people eater. These Malinois dogs are incredible. Now the cool thing about these dogs is they're so well trained that even though that dog would literally spend the rest of his life trying to kill you if he had the opportunity, if he was told to, <laughs> I can also approach him and say, hey, Bob, I'm a good boy, it's a good boy, and he doesn't kill me. These dogs have more energy than 10 cans of Red Bull, but like they, <laughs> when they get told to sit down, they do it, but they're just like, come on, give me, give me something to do. So what we're gonna do is go through a series of exercises today to show you just how capable these i don't want to call them monsters but they're part monster part angel i guess is the best they're way to velociraptors yeah the velociraptors so i've got my son mac right mackie uh we're going to show you how they protect children we're going to show you how they protect properties we're going to show you how they can jump out of a helicopter and stop a perpetrator You name it, they can do it. However, guys, I wanna show you something. So this video you're watching right now, right? The one that gave you that bruise and that bruise, these wild dogs. Well, our editor, Eric, has been like working some super long hours to be able to get this thing done. And I just popped in and we found an absolute damn tragedy. The man is absolutely out. He's been eating like crap and working long hours, pretty sure those don't have any vitamins or minerals or nutrients. So we've got a plan to help get this video back on track because if he doesn't, the video's gonna end right here. So you ready for this? Athletic greens. Athletic greens. You guys know that we talk about athletic greens all the time. Why? Because it's awesome. Watch this. When you order, when you order athletic greens, one of the packages that you can buy comes like this. You open it up, the powder canister. Nice. You got yourself actual athletic greens itself which is a blend of over 75 different vitamins minerals nutrients superfoods like literally everything that your body needs warmth and craves to give you energy focus health all the good things right here in one convenient serving also it comes with this handy water bottle which does not come pre-filled we did a little tv magic there on you and last but not least a really nice scooper this is like aluminum it's a nice scooper not some plastic junk so you take this you grab your greens off the top like this pour it in here in your handy dandy canister just like so no messes no whammies bam Ooh. you partake of the green dust as it wafts around the room you grab your scoop open your bottle guys i'm telling you this is so freaking simple i do it literally every day we go in there we we'll give her the old shaky shake so now you've got 
how many ounces? We got eh, probably about 12 ounces of absolute pure mm. mana nectar from heaven. Ladies and gentlemen, one scoop of this could replace like 9,000 other supplements that you take. I don't know if it's 9,000, but it's a lot. It's over 9,000! What 9,000? In fact, I stopped taking literally probably 20 different supplements because they're all right here in one convenient serving. So as you can see, old Eric could use a little boost. So what are we gonna do? We're gonna give him a little boost. Just a nice little sip, sip. Just a little. And then. Ah! <laughs> Welcome back, Eric! Is this Athletic Greens? To help me get the video done? The popper scared me. I didn't know the popper was happening. Surprise! I thought I popped his face off. <laughs> That was the most confused I've been in a long time. <laughs> Anyways, guys, listen, Athletic Greens. We continue to talk about them because they continue to make us feel good. These bruises are not from Athletic Greens. <laughs> These are from what you're gonna see later on in this video. So anyways, thank you Athletic Greens for continuing sponsoring the videos and continuing to allow us to create incredible content. And now, which this is the most important part because if you don't do this part, we might not be able to make any more videos. That's not true, but you should do it anyways. Link in my description, right? That's gonna take you to their website. On your first order, they're gonna give you five free travel packs plus a one year supply of vitamin D, absolutely free. Guys, I'm telling you, this stuff's legit. I drink it, I don't know if there's a limit, but I have at least two scoops a day. I feel good, look at Eric. And now, you gonna be able to finish the video? We might actually get this video done. Holy crap! <laughs> Click the description below. Get feeling better now. I don't want you to watch this video and go out and be like, oh, I'm gonna buy a Malwa. Because these things are high maintenance. It's like owning a Ferrari and doing burnouts in it every single day, right? Like that's gonna be hard on it. So you have to constantly keep up on making sure that the training is good because he was just talking to me, uh, Chad was saying, you know, if you have these dogs and you were to leave them in the backyard and you weren't like, you know, taking care of them and maintaining them, you'd come home and your backyard would literally just be destroyed because they have so much energy, so much strength, so much power. Uh, a Mountain Wah average size is 70 pounds? A male is typically 70 to 80 pounds. Okay. A female are anywhere from 50 to 60. Now there's some resemblance between these dogs and German Shepherds, right? Yep. Same family? Uh, so Malinois were actually around before German Shepherds, okay. but very similar dogs. I mean, a lot of people that see these think that they're German Shepherds. Yeah. So they see them in police canine, military, whatever, and they think, oh, that's a that's a small German Shepherd. Is it a French breed? In in theory, it's a Belgian Shepherd is what this is. So you have oh, a German okay. Shepherd and a Belgian Shepherd. It's basically it. what these dogs are. These are really enjoyable dogs to be around. I'm telling you right now, like, I wasn't sure what to think of these because I've never had kind of an up-close experience. I, I, my dog, for example, the Borble, Nobody gets close to that dog. In fact, Dave has told us, if we're out in public and you know walking, everybody sees big floppy ears. Oh, can I pet your dog? Dave's like, hell no. Tell them no way, keep them you know, a good perimeter. And there's a reason for that. So the difference between a protection dog and a guard dog, like these guys were just telling us, is, is a, a guard dog is something that my dog at home, I leave him there and he's just keeping an eye on the place. A protection dog is something that you can take out, you can use as a tool. Like you can control where they're going, what they're doing, what, you know, who they're gonna attack. And so that's why we're gonna go through this series of exercises today. They brought seven dogs. We have five out right now. We may bring the others out, may not, right? Yeah, we'll probably just use the five. Yeah, I mean, what's the most dogs that you've had somebody attack? I mean, we had eight dogs. We biting. just did it on me. <laughs> <Just a couple laughs> of we weighed them out. It was about 550 pounds. We had I had one dog here, one dog here, one dog here, one dog here, 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 and here. Gosh. And most of these we dogs put them we all on. We had to stick them on the bites because there's no way we could send them all. I'd <laughs> yeah. be slaughtered. Yeah. You, you guys right. actually have a really cool TikTok, right? So, so go check out their TikTok. High, uh, it's at High Caliber Pro Dogs, yep. and they've got a bunch of videos showing all the different capabilities. We're going to show a few of those capabilities today, but if you want to learn more. Um, and you guys sell these dogs as yep. well? Most of our protection dogs are gonna range from 45,000 up to 75, 85,000. Post, post training and everything? That's training, that's socialization, that's about a year and a half worth of training. We just barely met all these dogs. Mac is sitting here playing with them, goofing around. They're just amazingly well-trained dogs, which is why the price tag is what it is. That dog over there, the far dog, that's it. she just turned 10. So wow. she's 10 years old, she still looks like she's Three, four. She I mean, the energy I mean, guys. even uh, even Gaio, who's 
three years old, they almost look the same. Yeah. And she's 10, she's still extremely active, she still bites very well, right. she still jumps, does everything. Yeah. Just the same as she did when she was five. So, so. that's a good girl. These dogs are ridiculous. <laughs> Oh, dog. Oh, hi. Hi, bud. Hi, buddy. He's had a pretty dog. <laughs> We're not gonna let these dogs bite our bare skin because that would just be pure chaos. You guys brought some bite suits. Should we see the bite suits? Right through you. Yeah. Let's pop the bite suits out and see what we're working with. Hi, yo. Hi, yo. Yes. Oh, that might slow me down to like 18 miles an hour. Josh. <laughs> For me, this is the most important piece. Of hardware right here. <laughs> this is an adult. I wear a youth, but <laughs> this will work. Now I noticed in some of your videos you don't wear gloves. The dogs don't go for your hands. A dog that bites at low low points, or a dog that wants to go for your feet to go for your hands. To be honest with you, that's a dog that's more out of like insecurity. I'm gonna bite you, but I'm gonna stay as far away from you as I can. Yeah. All these dogs are trained technique. We teach them to bite here. Gotcha. We teach them leg technique. We're to bite specifically here, so it's safe for them, but it's also safe for the decoys that are catching these right. dogs. Um, a lot of these dogs are competition dogs as well, so keep them safe, keep them yeah. healthy. And they I have, have a dog. That momentum when they run up on somebody, it'll knock a full grown man down. I think I saw you get knocked down in one it'll, of your videos. It'll it'll Straight level it'll level you. Absolutely level you. <laughs> it'll take you off your feet. So these are all, all these suits. There's a lot of people that make suits, but this is a company out of France. They make the best bite suit on the planet as far as it goes durability wise. Not um, Kevlar or anything like there, that. There's a Kevlar weave in some of these suits, but this one doesn't have it particularly. But I want to wear this to the club. Yeah. You can see she's getting all excited about that. Oh yeah, hey, easy. <laughs> <laughs> Mackie, guess what? Do you know that dog's gonna bite me? They're gonna, they're gonna, they're gonna say bite him, and then feel my arm. Can you, can you pinch my arm? My arm. It's getting it right You can't right even there. feel it, huh? See? Sure. So these these suits are made so that when a puppy's learning how to bite, that he can't hurt me. A ninja comes to get you, and then this dog is gonna say, "Nope, Max, my friend, I'm gonna protect him." And my dog, you find your helicopter for me, and that's the end. I don't need. What if I land on you with the helicopter? <laughs> well, then the dog's not gonna be able to help much with that. <laughs> No idea what normal life is. He's like, but yeah, what if you just land the helicopter, Dad, and take me away? Uh, so. Wear your shorts. Wasn't <laughs> <laughs> too. Hey, is that my cup? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> That's, That's the one. A lot of trust there. <laughs> Two cups? How did that was mine? <laughs> 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 still through Dude, the yeah. You missed it. <laughs> Look at his face. He's done it a million times. Look at his face. That's what. What did I miss? <laughs> Look how out of, out of breath he is. If he does it that far, it'll kill him. Let's do it. Do it how far? <laughs> okay, so we're somebody's gonna die then. He'll hit your center mass, but if he hits your center mass, he'll just blow your sternum up. Yeah. So he needs to hit you here, and when you catch him here, you're basically just gonna just gonna swing him. Just like, just like catching a ball, like, just absorb it. Would a borble do this? No. Yeah, okay. Watch him. Yeah. 
How's it going, man? Good to see you. So it, it just kind of simulates what might actually happen. Guy OPA, because like in a, in a real attack, they're not going to sit there and lay there and be like, hey, call your dog. They're going to be screaming, you, you, you just got stapled, right? And yeah. Take it easy on me, Annihilator. Hey, Annihilator, I'll go down easy. Just make it look like you got me. You don't have to kill me. It goes for everybody here. I got treats, I'll get Beto's burritos, I'll get whatever you guys want. Hey, oh, all right, all right. Hey, both of you, listen up. I'm gonna break left. You guys go right. It's okay if you don't get me. I'll hide in the bushes. You can pretend like you found me. You can tell everybody else that you found me, but just don't kill me. I got treats for you. I got treats. This guy, this guy is, he's ready to kill. You don't have to use those. Look at these. My goodness. Did he say 600 pounds of pressure? Like a they, small car running over me? Compared this dog bite on your arm to being ran over by a small car. I heard that. I just want to make sure you heard the small car part. I was just wondering why I wasn't told this before today. But luckily they're just as fast as me. 25 miles an hour. Are <laughs> Strap straight. It's gonna be super fast. Guy, okay. Okay. Animals love you too much. They're never gonna attack you. He's gonna run up to bite you, but then just cuddle. Just wait till I get it on, Guy. Oh. Okay. Did you say crotch in French? He's gonna hit you right here. Okay. So just no, down a little bit. Ready? Attack! Hey, put some tape over your nips there, Dave. <laughs> I feel like it's, this material might be too thin. <laughs> Can I get a second one? This is just a base layer, right? <laughs> Good boy. He's got me. He's got me. He's got me. I got you. Duck. Duck. Oh, duck. He's got it. Watch! Watch! I'm gonna send him from a little further away now. Ready? I don't want a 600 PSI titty twister. I came into this whole program today thinking, it'll be fine, the bite suits, they're made to protect you. But watching my friend Dave, who's afraid of pretty much nothing, like super nervous, it just got me wanting, you know, just second guessing everything, I guess. Still excited. I can't breathe, okay. <laughs> Pull it all over my boot. <laughs> 
I think the next video we do, we put these on and just run into traffic. Yeah. Oh, Whoa. Jiminy, that scared me. me. <laughs> yeah, I'm not. Oh, oh yeah, now you're gonna. Ah! <laughs> you're getting the ball on me. <laughs> <laughs> that is intense. I don't come. Gary, I don't come. Uh, your son didn't carry. Where the hell does that strength come from? Little update for you. The bite suits don't work. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Okay, so that's that's uh that's intense. <sighs> oh my god. These dogs are awesome. What does heat stroke feel like? Because it's you're such an this, adrenaline rush, you don't know how to breathe. Yeah, when you're and you doing can't this, control your breathing, it, it just you makes, fatigues you so quick. It's crazy. Like I could do this, and I won't even start breathing. You go do it, and you're like <sighs> dying. It's it's pretty holding your breath. Yeah. I never thought of it that way. Just, just the adrenaline pumping yeah. through you is shutting off everything you're able to do. I, uh, I got a <laughs> I had a I got a meeting that I forgot about. You guys just carry on. Even through the bite suit, those guys got some serious. <laughs> you all right? You know what he calls those? Naki, what are you drinking, bud? What is that? Heavy D. Heavy D. Heavy, heavy D. D. <laughs> <laughs> and the best part was he didn't know that, that people call me Heavy D. And one day he just was telling my, my wife, he's like, Mom, I want some Heavy D. She's like, what? I want Heavy D, you know, at the hangar, Heavy D. And she's like, I don't know what you're talking about. Sunny D. So, like I was saying, this right here, this is a personal guard dog. This is one who's meant to stay at home, at the farm, whatever. Just hang out, lounge around. When something bad happens or somebody bad comes around, he just goes insane. Just animal instinct, right? You guys saw in the last video I talked about Zion, how we have to, have to introduce him to people, and it's constantly learning. Like, I just learned something new about how to control him now. Sit up, sit up, sit up. How much tension this shows you? Here, let me see him. Hey, stop it. Knock it off. Heel. Like, oh, yeah. Sit. That guy. <laughs> Knock it that off. That guy. So for me, like, I don't ever let him pull. If anything, I just give him a little pop. You compare it to that dog right there who is not being held on to. He's just holding his ground exactly perfectly because he's, you know, highly trained every single day. But this is a good dog. Perfect for family protection. Perfect for just being a big lovable beast. So. He's doing pretty well right now considering the sensory overload right now. Our competition dogs are trying to do what's called a guard of object. So basically you could take a bicycle, a kid, anything like that all. Basically the dog will guard that and the guy will come up and try to take that and the dog will guard it and as soon as you get close enough, he'll bite you, then let go and go back and guard it. Mm -hmm. Bite you, go back, let go and guard it. It's pretty cool. Yeah. All right, Annie. Are you ready to have some fun? Up here. Up here. Up here. Up here. I'll see you rest. I'll see you rest. Up here. Oh, shit. I forgot my extension cord. Hey, guard. <laughs> Ooh. Is that a Furman generator? And it's only that dog? I don't really like that generator. Hi, keep your generator. 
Good boy. Good boy. OPA. 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 Good boy. OPA. OPA. Good boy. OPA. OPA. Good boy. OPA. OPA. Guard. Guard. Can I put a little thing on me and I can be what it's guarding? For sure. Do it. I'm just gonna get stepped on for like 20 minutes, right? That's you guys' plan here? Guard. I really enjoy this actually. <laughs> I've never felt so loved in my entire yeah. life. Yeah, that's right, Diesel. Get your hands. I'm gonna get your hands. Right, good luck. Let's step on it one more time. Oh, this is actually really <laughs> Go get him! What can I say? Attack? Sick balls! Sick balls. <laughs> I feel like nothing in this world could protect me as much as that dog was protecting me right there. Never once. Nobody has tried to kick you as hard as I have. Wait, you kicked me really hard. Just so we're clear, you kicked me really. I see. Boucher! <laughs> Annihilator, come. Touche. <laughs> she can jump up at the main gun. Not in the crotch! Guys, this is, this is wild. When I set this up, I thought, it'll be cool. It'll be entertainment. I've seen their TikTok page. I've known Dave forever. He's a great trainer. I had no idea what to expect though, because this is, it's so much more intense. Like, it takes a lot for me to feel adrenaline. I am still literally, it's like pumping through my veins right now. I can't even imagine how this guy feels. He's been getting hammered. Finally, finally feeling adrenaline. Yeah, yeah. crash test dummy over good. here. Feels good to get some again. Those welts aren't gonna feel good later. I bet your body's covered. I can't yeah, wait to see that. You're gonna see my whole body? I'm gonna see every square inch of it. Okay. <laughs> I hope I got that. <laughs> oh, he's coming in. Let's see your arms, buddy. So, are you, is this? Oh my gosh. <laughs> came in Not bad. How many times did he got me right in the nuts. <laughs> That's probably quite a few. He got me. 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 He
got me. He got me good. Yeah. These dogs are so awesome. I mean, today what do we do? We jumped out of the helicopter. We had to protect our families. They guarded our, our gen generators, our Furman generators. There's nothing these dogs can't do. And now I think I'm gonna have to get one. I've already got the bite suit because I managed to ruin your bite suit in one day, right? Guy will come. All right, buddy, all right, buddy, all right. Guy will come. Good boy. But seriously, the Malmo dog is probably one of the raddest dogs I've ever encountered. And these guys train them better than I've ever seen any dog train in my whole life. If you want to learn more about these dogs or possibly even get one, where do they go, Chad? HighCaliberProtectionDogs.com. Um, great way to follow us too is on our Instagram page at HighCaliberProtectionDogs. That's our uh, Instagram as well. Um, these dogs are, as they said in the very beginning, they're not necessarily for everybody, but we'd love to educate you. Um, if it's something that you guys might be interested in for your families or for home defense or home protection, definitely give us a call. Um, again, www.highcaliberprotectiondogs.com and be sure to follow us on Instagram as well. And uh, as far as goes for rough swag, we make these collars as well. David, why don't you go ahead and tell us about the rough swag? Yeah, so if you're looking for any high quality dog gear, collars, uh, leashes, toys, that kind of thing, we make all the stuff that we use for our dogs, we make it um, or have high-end suppliers that supply it for us. And then we sell it on our website, roughswag.com. And then we also made a, uh, so this one of them, <clears throat> this is personalized collar for him. So different colors, tons of different color options, uh, embroidered name or whatever you want to put on it. Uh, high, extremely high quality buckle as well. So you should get one of those for hands. Yeah, <laughs> I, I, I definitely would. I think it fit them nicely. Um, but yeah, so, uh, and then we also have a discount code for you guys. So if you put in heavy D, they're gonna pop this up on the screen, heavy D, uh, that'll get you 15% off. So come check us out, roughswag.com. And the same at roughswag on Instagram as well. Guys, these guys are by far the best in their industry. <laughs> and this guy is the very best in his industry. I'm talking, they got a dog that will attack and protect your family. They'll protect your stuff. But at the same time, you can take kids out to the yard, lay down and cuddle with the dog, play fetch. Like, it's the best, the best of the best. So check them out for sure. They told you where to go. I'm gonna go get out of this hot, sweaty sauna suit. It's supposed to be a bite suit, but I turned it into a sauna suit. I might have lost like 20 pounds. See you next time.